CL, it's clear that Pete Rock doesn't want to work anymore. Shout out to Nori uh, over at Drink Champs. Yeah. Um, th those guys do a great job over mm -hmm. there. Yes, sir. Um, and I saw CL on there, mm -hmm. and he was making his plea. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like, man, I, I would love to get back in the studio for the fans. What do you, what do you, is that, maybe, I don't know about, now you're doing something, but. I, I just think he's best on his own. Okay. Know? As simple as that. I just think he's good by himself. He, there's a million producers that will do something with him. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. um, I'm, I'm good. Yeah, that's. I mean, we everybody's at different stages of life. Yeah. We, all, we all evolve, and it, mm -hmm. it, 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 it sounds great in theory, but mm -hmm. if everybody ain't aligned, mm -hmm. it doesn't happen. Energy. You know how it goes. Energy. Mm -hmm. Energy. And that's cool, but that doesn't mean you have to stop making music. It's been quite some time, so. As a fan of your music, an avid fan, here's what I would do. First off, link with the producer. People thinking, well, who would you? Maybe someone like a No ID who's very good at putting together full bodies of work, right? If you don't want to go that route, maybe Midwest. Stay in the Midwest. High tech. He's a hybrid, right? DJ, very good at sampling, analog sound, but he also has an ear for live instrumentation. A third option could possibly be maybe Knife Wonder slash Crisis because they're like, they're big fans of Pete Rock, right? But if you go that route, bring in someone like a Terrence Martin, right? He, that way we, we come full circle with it. Also, songwriting is key, right? So we all know you're a dope lyricist, but throughout the course of your career, you pretty much allow Pete Rock to laid down the hooks, utilizing samples, and you worked around it. Now, you've done your own choruses, but for the most part, you've done uh, the first option that I stated. So, this time around, link with someone like Crystal Johnson. You got a dope chemistry with her. Uh, she was on Take You There. Great uh, vocal tone. She's a great writer. And I think that could work. Thirdly, an engineer is everything. Because part of the Pete Rock and CL Smooth uh, fanfare, it's not just the beats and rhymes. You guys had a sound. Now, I'm not saying that you have to go back and replicate that sound. But if you're going to go forth and make an album, which I think you should do, and not wait on Pete Rock, make sure you get an engineer that, has a special, that specializes in both digital and analog. You know, outboard gear, two-inch tape, whatever works. I don't know, maybe Jamie Stowe was willing to work with you again. Bob Powell, there's a bunch of them out there, but you got the resources, make it happen. Don't focus too much on the comparisons, that's gonna happen. Just like Pete Rock and Common, the auditorium is currently being compared to Pete Rock and CL Smooth's previous work. That is going to happen, that's part of the game. When you make great music, that's what people do, they compare, right? But here's the thing, when working with a new producer, the only way to develop a sound, as you know, because you've done this, is to get the necessary reps in, right? So that means that's gonna come with some duds, some mediocre joint, and some fire, but you just gotta work through it. Because as I stated in the beginning of the video, as Pete Rock pretty much stated, it looks like that's never gonna happen again, right? But we wanna hear music from you. So don't just stay there. The world wants to hear CL Smooth, what's up? Link with a producer, I'm pretty sure as many producers who wanna work with you, and make it happen. Time is of the essence. All Sold Out came out, what, 33 years ago? Mecca and the Soul Brother came out 32 years ago. And the main ingredient came out 30 years ago. If you guys didn't decide to do an album between that time, I wouldn't bet on it. Although, I would be one of the first people to support it if you decided to. As a fan, I want to hear CL Smooth. Let's make it happen, man. All the producers out there, link up with CL Smooth. Oh, and also, if you get a feature, we got to have CL Smooth and Little Brother. Fuck all that. Right. Let's get work. Let's go. Right. You know, work. I'm not asking for you to be my brother no more. I'm not asking you to be my friend. Mm. I'm asking you to work. Right. Just work. Just, just work. And I'm not asking you to necessarily do it for me because now I understand. Mm hmm I understand that the fans gave us a lot. Mm -hmm. We owe them. 
They bought a couple of houses, a couple of cars for us. They bought, they gave us a few budgets. Like, this is so dope to why can't you Thank just you. give them something back? Like, right. just, here. Yeah, this here, is dope. Hold that. Here, just give them something back. I'm not asking you to say, yo, now we're going to have tea together every Tuesday. Nah, I love you. Tea, Let me love you from afar now. Yeah. I love in the space you at with Common. I love it. Right. Hey, yo, Eve. 